The Oceanic Fish Restoration Project, or the project, is a partnership between NOAA, NIFWIF, and the U.S. Pelagic Longline Fleet in the Gulf of Mexico. The primary goal was to be able to leave more fish in the water, to give fish more of an opportunity to grow and reproduce. The secondary goal was to alleviate some of the economic impacts that could occur by fishermen not fishing. So we worked with them to use an alternative gear that allowed them to decrease the amount of fish that were unwanted, we call that bycatch. So they were still able to catch fish and this also helped them be able to support the shoreside businesses that rely on a steady supply of fish coming over the dock. With this alternative gear project, we're making shorter trips. With this stuff, they're three, four, five days old. Kaboom! That's fresh fish. Oh, I sell out here at Katie Seafood. My fish come off of here, they go right there in the wholesale or in the retail market or right there to the restaurant. In recent years, our customers have been more focused on trying products that are sustainably caught and fished and stuff that's local. And the green stick tuna is one of those things that we can market as that. The buoy fish uh, is really changed the industry dramatically. Anything that's not sustainably caught, we don't sell. Um, as far as the buoy fish, uh, this is a big part of our company. As we continue to grow, I want it to continue to be uh, a big part of who we are. By working with fishermen to test new and alternative gears, it gives them a chance to figure out what may work for them in the future. And these gears in particular are focused on reducing bycatch. So one of the results was 90% of the bycatch was released alive. This partnership and this project laid the groundwork for future projects, having built these relationships and being able to show that this kind of project does work to restore fish.